After you complete signing up for your PayClock Online trial, you will receive an email with your login credentials and a link to the PayClock Online Setup Assistant. You will only need to set up Assistant if any of the following conditions apply. You want to migrate data from an existing PayClock desktop installation. You want to set up a QuickBooks integration. You want to set up a PayClock USB terminal. Or you want to set up a PayClock face recognition RPC100 terminal. You can also download the setup assistant from the link below. Follow the prompts on the setup assistant for all the settings that apply for you. After the setup assistant has been installed, you will now be ready to access your PayClock online account. Please note, if you did migrate from an existing version of PayClock desktop software, your password will now be the password from that existing software. On first login, if you migrated from an old version of PayClock, you will see all of your migrated data and you are ready to explore PayClock online. If you did not migrate any data, we'll first want to set up your pay class information. Select set up from the navigation list, select pay class from the flyout menu. The pay class information window will display. Select the default pay class name standard from the list, or if you want to create a new pay class, use the new button. From the general column of the pay class tab, set the desired pay period. Set the starting date of your pay period at the current pay period start date. At round registrations by select the rounding rule to use when calculating punches. Continue to overtime, break, premium time, consecutive day, or advanced tabs to complete your setup. Next we'll add your employees. Select employees from the navigation list. The employee information window will display. Choose new. The window will open to set up the new employee. Enter the employee's last name, first name, and middle initial. At name at terminal, enter a nickname for the employee if desired. This field is only used with the face in clocks. If wages are to be tracked in pay clock, enter the employee's hourly base pay. If the employee is salaried, select the salaried hours option to enter how many hours the employee is expected to work during the pay period. Enter the employee identifier your company uses in the employee number field. Enter the employee's PIN. Please note, what is entered in the PIN field will also cross-reference with the face-in clocks. The employee PIN is the same as the user number in those face-in units. Enter the employee's badge number under badge number. From type of employee, choose whether this person is going to be regular, temporary, seasonal, or contract. Select the pay class to be used. Select the home location. Select the employee's home department. Enter the employee's hire date. And from personal, advanced, picture, and custom fields, configure any additional settings needed and select save. We will now want to set up your time clocks. If you're using a USB-based time clock or PC100, your clock was configured during the setup process. For all other units, we'll follow the following steps. To set up a face-in terminal, follow these steps in Pay Clock Online. Choose Clocks, Manage Clocks from the navigation list. Press New. In the list, choose FR650 or FR700 and press Select. In the device nickname field, put whichever name you desire for your face-in unit. In the serial number field, put the serial number for your time clock. In the IP address field, put the IP address that was typed into your time clock. Press Save. To set up the PC600, follow these steps in Pay Clock Online. Choose Clocks, Manage Clocks from the navigation list. Click New. In the list, choose the PC600 and select. In the device nickname field, put whichever name you desire for your PC600. In the serial number field, put the serial number from the back of the clock. Click Save. At the clock, follow these steps to complete the setup. At the PC600, tap Admin. The Enter Pin screen will display. Tap the numeric keys for the Admin Pin, then tap Enter. The Administrator main menu screen will display. Tap Network Setup. Tap Define Host. 
the select connection method screen will display. Tap hosted. At the confirmation message, select yes. The connected server screen will display. Press the connect button. The PC600 will connect to the online pay clock database over the internet and update itself. When complete, the clock will be ready to use.